Because I need to clean your lens. But I guess the lens is okay. It's just your screen that's dirty. Yeah. No, it's... You want to see if I have a tissue with the handle? No. no. is incomplete. Intended for Dennis Houston brings up second down set. I'm gonna go try to commentate this. I'll be right back. That's complete to Isaiah Hall. First down yardage to the 43. 43, yes, thank you. Like always. Okay. And it's thrown. And the pass is complete. Aaron Boyd there to offer that record pass attempt to do even five. Second down, 10. Could not make it, First or maybe he did. He's just not here. Of course, uh, I'll stop. Make any sense, anyways. <laughs> okay, and first and down, first and goal on the, and he is brought down at about the, the thirty-two. I said forty-seven, didn't I? Okay, it's at the second down at the 36. It's like. It looks like it will be either a touchdown or a it will be on the goal line, whichever. It is pass complete to Ethan Fry down to the SFA one yard line. Oh, one yard line, okay. Richard Gordon makes the stop for the lumberjack. First and goal for the one. They're going to make this, and they get their first touchdown. It will be six to nothing. And Drew Hayden goes in for one yard out for the touchdown. Don't get two down yet. It's only the uh, it's only the first quarter. You never know what will happen. Okay. Okay. And they're going to go for the PAT attempt. And they hike it. Looks like it will be good. Extra point by Alec Chadwick is good. And the Huskies lead 7-0. 7-0. Drive good. Time out. Okay, there will be a timeout for taken by 
looks like. All right, fans, direct your attention to the field as SFA Director of Athletics, Robert Hill, recognizes and thanks Jim Roberts, Secretary of the Board, and Jessica Henderson, Board Member, okay. in recognition of Nacogdoches Memorial Health sponsorship of this afternoon's game. Thank you very much. Now, looks like, um, touchdown, I believe, or right, fans, make sure to catch the Coach Clint Conk radio show at CC Smokehouse coming up Thursday, uh, this fall at 7 o'clock. Come get the inside scoop on players, opponents, and hear the game plan straight from Coach Clint Conk at CC Smokehouse. Our next show is going to be coming up Thursday, October 26th, and we hope to see you there. For more details on future dates, visit sfajax.com. Hey, yeah, um, he, he said what I was about to say. Okay, um, sorry. And it looks right. I got two. Like still on timeout apparently. Okay, it looks like SFA has zero everything. No touchdowns, no first downs, no rush yards, no pass yards, no uh, TOP. Okay. Looks like the ball will be back. Timeout is over. And the kickoff. Side kick and it goes out of bounds. That will be a penalty. That will be a penalty. Okay, the penalty will be uh, a on the field. The penalty will be a rolling on the field for the ball going out of bounds. Legal kick out of bounds. Kicking team number 38. Ball went out at the 36 yard line. Five yard penalty will be added to that. First down. First down. It will be at the 44 yard line. No, the 41. Never mind. Wow. And they get it. They will go and they will gain exactly zero yards. They will gain exactly zero yards. Same. No gain, second down set. No gain. Looks like that'll be a gain of three. Garrett Dolan on the stop there for the Huskies. No, that'll be a gain of two. Third down eight. Third down and eight. Looks like they might have to punt this one. They should go for a passing play. Okay, they're gonna hike the ball. And he's loose. He's going to get sacked. Fumble! Fumble! Oh, that's good! Uh, 
And the Jags recover. <laughs> Looks like they recovers the bubble. Looks like they will have the play back to the 32. A fourth down on the 40 on the 42. On 32. I think this is a way to make two bucks. Going to be a punch. <laughs> Looks like they are going to punt. That's what I would recommend. They're replaying it. Okay. He's kicked it. And looks like he will not run it. Okay. Sorry about people walking right in front of me. Very rude. Okay, so the ball will be on 33. You never know what will happen. Huskies have the ball. And it looks like it will be incomplete on the sideline. Even if it was caught, it would, out of bounds, it would still count as incomplete. Okay. Be second at game of nothing. And they will throw it, and it looks like he will be knocked down. Maybe getting the first down. Yes, he gets the first That's down. Anthony Jacobs on the stop. See. First and ten to the forty-four. This is why I don't play football. And it looks like. idea. It is four to go for a first down, but they will not go for it, and they will kick it right away, and there we go. He catches it. 
Wooten, the Bearcats, about the eight. Timeout. Timeout. Looks like it will be taken by the Lumberjacks. It will be on the eight yard line. It's where the punt recovery will be. Look around you. Someone near you, Sorry. dear to you, or even right next to you, is stronger than you may know. Okay. Because one in eight women will be affected by a breast cancer diagnosis, which makes early detection, awareness, and access to the best care even more important. For these women, the families, the friends, and the neighbors, we salute their strength, their courage, the challenges and the victories. They are more than survivors. They are conquerors. Which just goes to show you, there is nothing we can't overcome when we all simply think.
down. Pass deflected by Terry Timmons. Brings up fourth and three. Fourth and three. Looks like they will probably punt it. Yep, they're gonna punt it. Standing at the end zone. They're standing at the goal line. Never mind. And he kicks it. And he goes out of bounds about the 46, or the 36. Time out. Fans, if you would, direct your attention to the video board. The Nacogdoches Economic Development Corporation's mission is to help existing businesses remain successful, to foster local entrepreneurship and to recruit new industry and business to Nacogdoches County. The majority function of NEDCO is supporting our existing local businesses. My name is Clarissa Philpott and I am the President and CEO of the Nacogdoches Economic Development Corporation. We work on retaining and just growing the community in general. With all of the businesses in the community, from very small businesses all the way up to our major employers. I love working with all of the people of the city of Nacogdoches who are our family. My favorite thing about my job is that I get to help to affect real change in the community. It's different every single day, and that's one of the reasons why I love it. On a daily basis, our most important function is supporting our local economy that's already here. It's not just recruiting businesses. Nacogdoches has a thriving small business community, and that is what makes Nacogdoches what it is today. And so we spend a lot of time supporting them. Looks like the time I'll see him the jazz. On the field representing Netco is Gary Stokes, Chairman, Robert Flores, Vice Chair, William Fayardo, Secretary, Ron Collins, Treasurer, and Ashley Morgan. SFA is powered by the City of Nacogdoches and proud to call it home. City of Nacogdoches is a proud partner of SFA Athletics. Yep. Same place. The high school. Uh, doing the high school. Huskies still got the ball. And they'll hike it. And he's sacked. He has been sacked. It'll be second down at will be second down at the thirty. It's a loss of about three. Thirty-three. Looks like it's thirty-four to me, but it's thirty-three. He's sacked again. He looks like he might be sacked again. No, he's not sacked. It'll be third down. Brian Woods, the stop brings up a Pilgrims. Third down and ten. It's the 37. I don't think that'll help you, buddy. Third down and ten to go. And we'll, hope we'll run it. And it's incomplete. Intended for Dennis Houston, incomplete. Brings up fourth down. 
down. I'm just running it back and forth. And we... Still seven minutes left in the, game, in the first quarter. And he'll punch it. Doesn't look like it'll go that far. And, and he has it at about the 19 yard line. Let's say minus five rush yards, two pass yards. Four first downs for HB, HBU. Okay. And Jax will have the ball at the 19, 18. It says 19, 18, but it's really the 19. And he runs, and it looks like it will be second down at the 22 yard line. Swing pass, and he was Real Brown first there for the Yep, I was correct, but it was a gain about three because they said it was at the 18, but it's really at the 19. Wow. Okay, and he and it looks like he runs it. Kyle Bowley there for the Huskies to make the top on. He's gone to Amos. I'll be again. Third down five. I'll be. It looks like it'll stay the same. Gain of one yard. I don't think they're going to come out with this. Sorry. They might make it unless. It, you don't wait. You always do not wait. For your running back. You never throw it to your running back. And he runs. He runs. But he does not get the first down. It's still fourth down. Very sad. Austin Holly on the stop. Five minutes left in the first quarter. When the first quarter ends, I'm going to give you a little. Mm, a, a little summary. Brandon, we just team. joined, but then we will. Um, we then we will give you, and they punch it very high, very high, and it looks like he kneels. That'll make the beer catch at the thirty-two. Winners today for the SFA Homecoming Duck Dash. First place went to John Rolf. Second place, Jim Hamilton. And third place, Ida Gonzalez. I hate people that just go right in front of my camera. Okay, it'll be... They're just pulling it backwards. the ball uh, and he gets down about the 35 yard line. Jack Swinton's wow. pass complete. Got another five to minutes ID. left in this game. Second down seven. Before we're over. Or not left in the game. Not not left in the game. Left in the quarter. Okay. And okay, he's brought he's sacked. He is sacked. He'll be out about the twenty seven yard line. Twenty seven yard line, yes. I'll bring up a third and sixteen. It's a pilgrim's third down and sixteen. Not, they have not been able to get in field goal range to actually get something on the board. Neither. Okay, and they, 
and the fumble. Oh, the fumble. Shuffle pass. Covered up well by Lamont Alexander and Rashad Pickles. And fourth down. I'll bring up fourth down. No, that was not a fumble. the 50. Come on, let's go, Drax. We can do this. Jake Lumberg on the keeper. First there for the Huskies was number 25, Kyle Foley. Game of four, second down, six. It'll be second down at the 42. <laughs> and he runs. Oh, he might be able to. And looks like he gets the first down. He will be at 50. He will be at the 50. 49. He will be at the 49. First and 10. First, the first, first down of the Jacks. The what? To his left? Okay. And it looks like it goes out of bounds. Almost makes it. No, we saw Well, we were still here. I'll be third down and ten. Still. Okay, okay, so it's gonna I'm just thinking if that was Cohen. I think it's Cohen girls. Okay, and third down, they might be able to do this. And looks like he throws it, and he gets it. He might, he might have the first down. Yes, he has the first down. No, he doesn't. Fourth and one. No, it is first down. It is, it is fourth down, the first down. They do get a first down, and they throw it. He looks Small like world running into them, and right. he gains about one yard. pass to Amos for about a yard. Going for the first there for the Huskies, the second down. <laughs> and it is incomplete. 
Pass was intended for Cody Williams, it's incomplete. Rafael Lewis coming in. Third down nine. It's thrown. Looks like he'll get a fourth down. Pass complete to Cody Williams. Cody Mock here there. Fourth and two. It's a gain of about eight. Brings up fourth down and a little bit more than a yard. Fourth and two. I'll say it's fourth and two. <laughs> Sigler was coming down the road with Yeah, I saw Sigler. Timeout. Sigler was coming down. Timeout. Okay, got 33 seconds left in the quarter. Timeout. Looks like they will go for it. And he throws, and it's incomplete. They'll bring turn up on down. Remember working concession stands? Oh, yeah. Oh, God. will <laughs> <laughs> be 31 seconds left. Looks like there is a flag oh, on the play. Oh, and then Dan Allen's are expecting too. Looks like there is a flag on the play. <laughs> That's interfering. 25. Defense. Just watch. Automatic first down. First, first down. 15 yard penalty. Pass interfering to the Hustlers. I'll bring them to the 23 yard line. Second down, he gets it. Looks like he gets a first down. I'll be at the 14 LB. No, it's third down. They're saying it's incomplete. First quarter. He kind of has adopted our family across the street. Ladies and gentlemen, under the direction of T.J. Maple and Stefania Castro, please welcome the 12-time and double reigning national champion, SFA Dance Teams. Kobe says outside, he likes that. Hey, this is that great 
Smoking pot, that AV, yeah, that dead dog. Hey, watch my soul speak. You let the past talk. Hey, I'm the realest arm um, after all. Um, tell her, be humble. Tell her, sit down. Tell her, be humble. Tell her, sit down. Like that'll bring up fourth down. I don't know why they tried to run it. Terry Dillon comes in to make the stop. And a that loss is of a yard brings up fourth down. A loss of a yard. They might go for it, but you don't know. If something happens, then it will be bad. They're at the 16 yard line uh, for second and three. Second and three, yes. Second and two. Yeah, second and two. And, and he goes for the PAT, and it is good. They do put something up on the board. That will be the end of this match. We will come back to you in the fourth quarter in about two to three hours. Thank you. Have a great rest of the day.